Countdown is on for the return of the Amped Electric Games. This year promises to be bigger and better because it's over a course of three days. There's going to be races, workshops, games, and more. Seth is here to fill us in on what we can expect this year. And he even asked Jennifer and I if we wanted to participate <laughs> on the unicycle that he brought in. But if you all just want to look at Jennifer and I's feet, like we are not equipped. These heels and wedges. So we'll just, we'll let the professional Take take that over. Seth, thank you so much for joining us today. Sure. Thanks for having me back. <laughs> yes, yeah. absolutely. Let's talk about the Amped Electric Games. What is sure. it all about? Yeah, so this is our second annual year. We bring in racers from all around the world, and they come out to Benton County Fairgrounds, and we do track racing, we okay. do jumping, we do stunts, artistic expression, all kinds of stuff. We'll have e-skate devices. We'll have one-wheel devices. It's going to be a lot of fun. Okay. Let's talk about why Bentonville was uh, selected to host an event like this. Sure. Uh, what I love about Bentonville is that the trail systems around here allow these types of devices, whereas a lot of places in the country and even in the world don't allow these types of devices. So it's really nice and progressive of Bentonville to embrace them. So you've got your unicycle here, but there's going to be lots of different unicycles that yeah. people can see. Let's talk about what kind of um, electric vehicles that people will be able to see at the event. Sure, sure. So this is called the Bigod A2, and this is kind of a smaller type of electric unicycle. Okay. But there, we also have one wheels. Those are like the skateboard things with a mm -hmm. big wheel in the middle. Oh, yes. You okay. may have yes. seen them yes. around on the, okay. on, the, on the square. And um, we're also going to have e-skate devices, e-skate races out there, e-bikes, um, all types of different electric vehicles so people can come out check out all the different types of vehicles at our expo yeah absolutely mm -hmm. jennifer do you have some questions i mean that? this looks like something from like back to the future <laughs> <laughs> like seriously where are like the pogo sticks and the right. scooters no more sure. this is it no hands yeah, yeah. <laughs> so i can tell you a little bit about it it's similar to a segway um but okay, we don't right. have any kind of a handlebar so it kind of it works like this it's all it's all done on balance so if i want to go forward i lean forward if i want to go back i lean back I just told Jack, it looks like good core exercises. <laughs> it is. Like you'd have good. to keep your core really tight. <laughs> yeah. I'm out. <laughs> Any, anybody could do it, all different age, ages and all different skill levels. How long have you been riding unicycles? Um, probably about three years now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What do you love most about it? Um, I, it's my therapy. Mm. I like to get out and just feel that wind in my face. And I don't think about anything else because when I'm going down the road, going 30, 40 miles an hour on one of these things, there's not a room, lot of room to think about <laughs> other things. Sure, and so right. it's kind of a, a zen space for me. Yeah, That's absolutely. It. Give us those dates on when the Amped Electric Games are happening. Yeah, so September 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Okay. Uh, the public can come out and check it out. Check out all the different types of devices that we have. Um, we'll be running our races from about 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. So if they want to see races and jumps and probably some crashes, <laughs> come on out to the Bend County Fairgrounds. Okay, I'm glad you said that because most of the time you're like, okay, surely everybody is a professional. Nothing's going to happen. But crashes can happen. You just never oh, know. Yeah, yeah. Okay, can you give us just a demonstration on uh, the unicycle? Sure. I don't know if, if you perform tricks on it. Well, I think just Stunts. just riding it is kind of a trick. You're correct. I mean, it, yeah, is, correct. it is a wheelie. Yes. <laughs> so, yeah, so these these devices, we actually have racers that, that go up to 55 miles an hour. So we'll be doing drag races on these things. We also have an oval track. We also have some jumpers that jump off of ramps. We have a little girl who's 11 years old. Her name is EUC Girl. She jumps 30, 40 feet in the air. You can find her on Instagram, oh EUC.girl. Um, so it's just amazing all mm -hmm. of the different talents that come out and, and perform out there. And I think that people will be really impressed and it's very exciting, fun for the whole family. Sure. Absolutely. Now you have another one uh, yeah. that you brought into yeah. the Are those the same or are they different? So these two devices, this one is actually called a Bigode M10. Okay. And so they're, this is like the little the little, little baby. Little baby. <laughs> okay. All right. And then they, they go up from here. So the ones I didn't bring in, they just get bigger and bigger and bigger. So it's really uh, all about the battery size. So 10 miles range, 20 miles range, 30 miles range, 40 miles range. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Man, I am just so nervous. Every time you get on there, you're like, oh, I just lean forward and I lean back. Right. I'm like, it can't be that easy. 
I actually have it crashed is. a Segway, so that really <laughs> scares me. Yeah. <laughs> And that was with the bar. So, yeah, I'm out. Well, Seth is a professional. No crashing in here today. Thank you so much for joining us Thank today. You. Let's bring up those details of the Amped Electric Games one more time if we can. There they are right there on your screen. We'll have a link over on our website for you to get tickets.